All right, we got our egg noodles. Those look good. So already cooked, just the way the recipe calls for. We're gonna grab some heart healthy mushroom soup, cream of mushroom. This stuff is so good. And it's less sodium, so it's good for the heart. All right. And then we're gonna grab some sweet peas. You could use frozen too if you want, but I really like that pea flavor. So I'm gonna use both of those. That looks good there. All right. Next up for this delicious recipe, we got some chicken of the sea tuna. That's pretty funny actually, chicken of the sea. Like, instead of, it's like a water chicken. <laughs> it's pretty, pretty good marketing right there. Just gonna pour all that in. My dog really wants some of this, but he ain't gonna get none. Okay, now let's grab a cup of milk as our last ingredient. Kind of thicken this thing up a little bit. Pour that in here. Make it nice and creamy. And now I'm just gonna kind of break, break up that tuna a little bit. Mix this together. That is smelling good. This will feed a family of like 20 too. Take this to your next church potluck or a little get together. This thing is gonna be amazing. Throw this together for a quick Thanksgiving dish. I don't know. Pretty cheap too. Maybe less than 10 bucks for all this. We're gonna put this in the oven at 400 degrees for 30 minutes and then we're gonna add on the breadcrumbs last. Look at that. That looks so good. Got a little crunch on the top. We're gonna add a little bit more crunch with this. So we're gonna do a, a teaspoon or tablespoon of melted butter. And we're gonna mix in some plain breadcrumbs. So let me set this aside. We're just gonna get a good heaping spoonful of that. We wanna pour that in our butter. Just to kind of get that nice and liquidy, get it thickened a little bit. Ooh, look at that. That looks good. Just kind of sprinkle those in. Those breadcrumb flakes. Just kind of, kind of spread them out a little bit. Kind of looks like brown sugar. That looks good. Okay, perfect. And then I'm going to do just a couple more. Just a little bit more of this over the top. It's a light layer. Okay. Now let's put this back in the oven for five minutes and then it'll be good to go. Oh man, that looks good with those breadcrumbs. Man, I just gotta dig into this. I'm so excited for this. Y'all, this is gonna be good. I'm just gonna get a big old piece. I mean, big old piece. I'm hungry today. Look at that. Woo-wee! That's what I'm talking about. All right. Guys, it looks hot, but I'm going to dig in. I can't wait any longer. I've been too hungry smelling this simmering. And look at those breadcrumbs. Those look nice and good. I'm just going to blow on this real quick. That should be good. We'll see. Gotta say, not a huge peas fan, but it definitely brings out the flavor. And that tuna, that's very creamy too, rich and creamy. This is an easy recipe, you guys gotta try that. Those mushrooms are great too, man. 10 out of 10.